In addition to helping food industry colleagues with FSMA compliance and FSMA readiness, we also work very closely with meat and poultry companies to make sure they're compliant with the USDA regulations, and that can take a wide variety of forms. We can be working with our colleagues on recall management. We can be working with our colleagues on preparing for and weathering food safety assessments, and we can be working with our colleagues uh, uh, responding to notices of intended enforcement. And interestingly, when it comes to NOIEs, uh, USDA has changed the rules. Now, unlike before, where we'd have a food safety assessment maybe once every couple of years, the agency has shifted its approach, and I think it's gonna have a substantial impact on the industry. Today, USDA is now, every month, determining which companies are of interest, which companies it wants to scrutinize more closely from a food safety standpoint. And that could be driven by tension, uh, between the inspectors on site or by other reasons or other risk profiles that the agency is conducting. And as a result, when the USDA shows up uh, for its next food safety assessment, it's going to be very intense and it's going to be very targeted. So we will stand shoulder to shoulder and we're proud to stand shoulder to shoulder with our colleagues in the industry, helping them weather those targeted food safety assessments, I call them TFSAs. Uh, responding to notices of intended enforcement when they're issued by the agency, or just ensuring that our colleagues' operations are compliant in all respects with the USDA regulations.